Custer's Last Stand, one of the craziest battles of American history. They had to take all the gold that they found and bury it, but when that happened, they ended up just losing the gold, and we're gonna find that gold. Do you think that the gold is still there, like currently today? They actually go to this side looking for a place to bury it. Look at your eyes, brother, you're scared. What's up guys, it's Sam and Colby. So how would you feel coming on an adventure or an exploration trip with us? We decided that on November 17th, we're gonna scroll back through all the people who've pre-ordered our new book, Paradise Island. Pick some people to come out on an adventure with us. You guys are either gonna get flown out to LA or we are going to go to your place to explore an abandoned place. Obviously we're waiting for it to be a little bit more safe out there, but it's gonna be awesome guys. We've never done something like this before, so we're super excited about it. And if you're under 18, you're still eligible. You just have to bring a parent or guardian. And if you're over 18, you can bring a friend. It's gonna be dope. Come explore some crazy stuff with us. Unfortunately, we can only do US as of now. Sorry about that guys, but the book is awesome regardless. If you don't wanna go, you should at least check this out because it was a scary, scary experience that actually happened to us. So. Unlike any other content we've ever done. Anyway, check it out. First link in the description, we know you're gonna love it. But without further ado, guys, hope you enjoy the full feature of the treasure of Little Bighorn. Whew. What's up guys, it's Sam and Colby. Today we have yeah. Guys, just you came to Billings just to come to Walmart. Yeah, we just randomly stumbled across them Starbucks down the street. We decided yeah. to film a video here in Billings, who Montana. Who lives in Billings? Uh, who lives in Billings, huh? Should have rented that. The RV? Yeah. What about the, the guy with the horn on his truck? Uh, easy, 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 horny truck right there. Oh so my god. So small, <laughs> weird For a big ass car, so just like that. Weird. Right now, we're visiting Walmart because they don't have them in LA. Let's go. Uh, we like Walmart. Yeah. Or this Hollywood. is a haunted Walmart. And we're here to find some demons. Overnight in Walmart, 100,000 likes and we'll do it. The door just opened by itself. No, it did not. Yeah. Uh, what did we get? We got some sleeping bags. We got a 12 person tent. You know what I'm saying? We got some food for tonight. We got some things to start a fire if we can. Why we get two tents? Two tents? Two tents. Oh, two tents. Why'd you get a 24 person tent? You got two, two tents 12s? out there. <laughs> two 12s? There's two tents back there. Two 12 person tents out? Two 12 person tents. Two tents. Why is it? I two hate tents? Sam right now. <laughs> What did I do? Tents. So what the fuck are we doing on this trip, man? Uh, we just realized that Montana is actually called the Treasure State. Yeah. For good reason, because there's a bunch of gold here. So we're gonna find it. We were a little bit unsuccessful in Cerro Gordo. We had a lot better lead, but this time we have you have us and Peter. we have them and Peter and we, Peter that you're about to meet. And we have this girl right here. Check her out. Hello. Yeah. Wave to the camera. We don't Wave. <laughs> She's gonna get up and beat her ass. Yeah, dude, dude, people are pissed off in Montana, I'll tell you that. So we're in Billings, and apparently there was a giant lost gold treasure burial thing like 200 years ago. Apparently yeah. there's 10 million current US dollars of gold. Imagine find. if we actually found it though. Three YouTubers and one complete idiot. We, you know, we, we know who it is. One complete idiot finding gold. We do know, Bitch, who, it. We do know who it is. Everyone's like that. <laughs> Whether or not we find the treasure in the ground or in our hearts or in Colby's asshole, we are Ooh. going to find some treasure. That's a deep spot. I'll go you guys are ass. gonna have to go pretty far. <laughs> That's a deep hole. <laughs> Let's go find out where this treasure's at. Let's get it. Peter? Hello. How, are you How you doing, Petey? Hello, hello. How's it going? Why, why are you guys doing the same story? What's your angle? Oh, just uh, we do it for YouTube, not the uh, TV. You stuff. do it for YouTube? Yeah, yeah, it's just like our own personal thing. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Well, how much of the story do you know? We've been doing some treasure hunting videos for the past couple of months, and so we're just looking at like the most famous like treasure hunts around. That's our Montana series. There's a minimum of 140 lost treasure stories that we started researching. Multiple treasures lost across the United States West in the country. But anyway, this gold got put on the ship. Uh, Longworth was uh, supposedly one of the uh, people with in charge of this wagon. 
And you he has two armed guards. Oh, he gets you, the yeah, yeah, you got a spider, so you have a, you have a spider on your head. head. That's okay. <laughs> it's gone. Okay. Anyway, uh, Grant takes on the gold and he goes and he finds out eventually he's got to take the wounded. I don't know if you guys learned this in school, but Custer's Last Stand, but it was literally like one of the craziest battles of American history. Mm -hmm. This is all surrounding around that battle. What happened is the U.S. government gave a couple tribes in Montana a specific lot of land. However, they realized after they gave them that land that there was a lot of gold on it. They wanted to take back that same land, and so they just decided to go and attack these tribes. Like, Even though they had a treaty with the tribes. It's so fucked. That's and sketchy. It's, it's yeah, messed up. definitely. It's like, here, you can have this land. Oh wait, there's gold on it? Let me get that back. I know yeah. I just signed something, gave you a contract and everything. He's messed up. U.S. government tried to come in, but all the tribe members like ambushed them and completely obliterated Custer's like whole army. So that was mm -hmm. awesome on their part because you know it was wrong of the U.S. government to go in. Uh, because he like lost all of his men, he had to get all of his wounded guys out of there as fast as possible, and that's where the treasure comes in. Legend has it that there was a Captain Grant Marsh who was the one that was taking a steamboat up there to get the gold and then go down the river with it. But since Custer's troops were in trouble and there was a lot of men dying, they had to take all the gold that they found and bury it and like leave it somewhere so they could pick up those troops that were hurt and then take them back instead. But when that happened, they ended up just losing the gold altogether. Mm -hmm. And we're gonna find it. And we're gonna find that gold. Okay, so this is a 1913 map. Here's the Little Bighorn River. Here's the Bighorn River, and they meet right here. This is the Battle of Little Bighorn right here. This is where oh, the actual right battlefield took place. In the meantime, Grant Marsh, he is supposed to be here. He actually misses this point, and he travels somewhere 15 to 20 miles further upstream, still looking for this. And he's, you know, getting ready to turn around and whatnot, and these people show up with this wagon and say, you know, do us a favor. We got a lot of gold. We can't take it on to Bismarck, but it would take it for us, okay? All they know is there's Indians everywhere and they don't want to be attacked. You know, they're trying to get back down here to where they belong. They actually go to this side, the west side of the Bighorn, looking for a place to bury it. And they headed out in the evening on this old trail, just enough light they can see a ridge off to this northwest. They find a little cave, they put the gold in and with the shovel and uh, Axe, they fill the entrance. Uh, one of the two hunters last time believed that this ridge was close enough to be the location where Marsh and his two crewmen buried the gold. Do you think that the gold is still there, like currently today? I found everything from Civil War buckles to buttons when troops mustered and lost stuff. Wow. wow. All the way to the old coins, you know, and I got this Indian head penny and I'm, is that 1877? Dang. Oh, wow. Yeah. Where are you going? Hard area? Pardon? I'm gonna tell you how to find these spots. Oh! oh. That's what we want. Um, know about the general Custer fishing access? Some people felt that, um, believe Custer used that crossing. Uh, we've heard people have told us that like the land that the tribes were on is haunted due to all, like all the deaths. Uh, the battlefield itself, the little Bighorn battlefield, a couple years ago published uh, an issue that gave all sorts of different people's accounts of experiences they've had on the battlefield. People who work there, <laughs> people like that where they you know like have heard and seen amazing things out there you know so i'd have to spend the night over there <laughs> i know holy sh there is so much history to this that's insane yeah. it's crazy I mean, that it's all right there massive battle thing that we lost they hit a bunch of gold there's a couple different re legends that on the same fishing creek that we're about to go on we could possibly find it on a the other side. A lot of information. We did. I think we got a lot more than what we like bargained for. You know what I mean? I know. Like, great. there's a lot more spots that yeah. could have. It's not like, a, it's not like a straight story, you know. Yeah. So that's why we have options, so, boys. And we then have options. also, he said the ranch that we're gonna stay on is haunted. So like, what? And yeah, no, like last minute, he's <laughs> no. like, oh hey, by the way, guys, <laughs> <laughs> like we have to stay there. Why are we by doing way, murder? Yeah. Murder and ghosts. Great. What you're saying. So let's go cool. see if we can. Magnet fish? Magnet fish and see all the spots where they think the legends uh, of the gold are.
Yeah, we gotta bundle up, guys. It's gonna be like 40 degrees. This must be cold. Oh my god. Oh, put on your All Saints. Ooh, there's a jacuzzi right there, dude. Yeah, there Let's we go. go. We don't we don't need anything, man. We got hot tub. Get our new Halloween Explore drip hoodie. Yes, thing. check that out. It's actually dripping. Oh, it's dripping everywhere. Look at this. <laughs> this is coming soon, guys. Okay. Big fat old jacket. Fat old jacket. Comfiest merch in the game, right, Kim? Yes, I put it on. Oh, dude, this is the comfiest. <laughs> Anybody wearing that? I just want to. Mm. Wait, what does that mean? You just want to do what? Oh. That's like a hug. You know how earlier they were saying that you can still fish on the same route? <laughs> You're just seeing this in the back of a truck like it's normal. <laughs> we're in the back of a fucking truck. We are. We're in the back of a pickup truck right now. I've <laughs> never done this in my we life. We found the fishing people. So, like, they they uh, decided, even though they don't do it during the nighttime, they were going to make an exception for us. They're going to show us the land where the treasure's on. And we literally have to float down the river. <laughs> you just hit the fucking head. <laughs> oh fucking God. knocked me out. They're going to show us the land where uh, General Custer's right, like, gold would be, and we might get to camp there too. So Ooh. let's get it. Are we going deep sea fishing? Yeah, we're scuba diving. No, deep river fishing. It's shallow river, dude. Oh, shallow river fishing. I could probably put my my new Nike blazers in there and still not even get them wet. That's how shallow it is. You've never ridden in the back of a truck? I have, but like, I was like, maybe three months old. Maybe. Step out of your comfort zone, better together. Dude, we, together. we are so much We are so much better together. We are better together. Way better together. No, so I like that. A, I like that saying, I don't know why. They should put that on a t-shirt. With a big old Somewhere. smiley face. Yeah. We're or a sweatshirt, because I'm cold. Oh, sweatshirts oh. would be nice. We that should look into that. I would buy like all of those. Dude, I would buy I would, the whole collection. I would sell it. I would, me personally, I would make it sell out just by me buying. Oh, there's the river right there. Oh! All right. So dope. Keep your eyes peeled. There might be eight hundred thousand million dollars worth of gold here. Dude, what if they just threw it like on in the river? <laughs> Hit it in plain sight. <laughs> oh! Oh, yeah. oh my gosh! Right, bro. I got it. I'm gonna get my fucking magnet fishing gear because I'm a magnet fisher now. When Sam and Colby, you look more like fishermen. No, you guys look like more fishermen than normal. This is a fisherman look. Yeah. yeah, you guys look like crab fishermen right here. <laughs> <laughs> hey, for all you fishermen out there, go grab the merch. <laughs> oh, this is it, boys. Oh my god. Oh my god, that came out of nowhere. Oh Alright, bye guys. <laughs> Sucks, dude. Hey, you guys look like fishermen. Thank you. But no, no one ever comes out here at night, right? No, no, this is very unusual. This is something we, we don't ever do. Really? Yeah. So, what about camping? No one just randomly sits around here and camps and explores, do they? No, no. Oh god. We're magnet fishing, everybody. I don't even know what magnet fishing was. I thought literally it was a fish called a magnet fish. Well, I mean, obviously we're trying to find some treasure, but treasure doesn't need to be gold. Treasure could be a 1800s iPhone. Don't let, don't let go of it. All right, drag her around a second. Oh, oh, you got something? I you got something? Pull her up, pull her up. What'd you catch? I got a rock. Yeah! Woo! Let's compete. Let's see how many things we can get. Get it. Oh! oh. No! What is this rose right there? Sediment that has. <laughs> it's so dust. <laughs> the dirt. Get a rock. Oh, 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 no. rock. A bunch of rocks, dude. Yeah, I can feel the bottom. Yeah, I can feel yeah. the tug. It's like scraping tongue. Dude, it literally feels like little nipples. So crazy. <laughs> oh! No way. Oh, no way. Yeah. Part of the railroad track. What? What the? We got one too. Whoa! Oh, no! These losers don't know how to fish. They can't even keep up with us. This is like where they collided. Where Randy from the museum said that the Far West ship was looking for this area when they still had like the gold in the ship. <laughs> oh god, dude, it looks like majestic, man. Dude. It looks nice, on you. We've been out here for like two hours going down this, this river, and uh, looks like this might be the best spot, eh? Where we gotta be at. This is along the lines and in like like my best, you know, judgment of like where it possibly could have been dropped off. So if you guys wanna go out here and start exploring, it'll be better than any other place. Yeah. We're just out in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> like I got some bear spray for you. 
Ba bear spray. Before the sun goes down, we gotta set up camp. Colby, did you get your treasure? Yeah, man. Oh my god, look at that treasure, dude. This is definitely worth at least a dollar. Oh, yeah. Damn, we're literally just getting dropped off right here, guys. So. I don't know if this is a good idea. Is, dude, look where we're at, man. We're gonna be miles and miles away from civilization until morning. And it's gonna be like 30 degrees tonight. Yo, but we got some exploring to do in a haunted forest. If you don't hear from us by tomorrow, uh, please call 911. <laughs> I was gonna say, I don't know if we have service right here, brother. I have one bar. One bar? Only one bar. I have a dead phone for a well, fishing I got hole. a treasure. Me too. I got the treasure, the buried treasure. You, we, <laughs> you guys touch treasures. Dude. Dude. <laughs> oh God, no! Uh, Goodbye. Yole, yole. Thank you. All right, let's go find a campsite, guys. Oh wait, this doesn't seem like a bad camping spot. This will be nice! <laughs> gotta go into the forest. Yeah, you yeah, dude. We gotta go in the forest a little you bit. Think they just threw the treasure right off the freaking river? Dude, it's gonna be 30 degrees. It's haunted. And we're all sleeping together. Whoa, 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 whoa. <laughs> what the <laughs> fuck is that, dude? I scare you, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> oh, oh, what? Oh, no! <laughs> what is it? <laughs> Didn't you say there was bears in here, bro? And rattlesnakes, dude. Dude, all right, so you go first. No, are we going go down in there? Yes. Should we go like- I don't want to go inside the bear nest that that <laughs> is. If there is actually a bear, what do we do? Yeah. Don't we all like just, act as big as possible? Yeah, you go like- uh, 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 You go just like- uh, Yeah. Uh, <laughs> the bear's like, dude, chill out. <laughs> just if you saw someone like <laughs> screaming at you, you'd be like, okay, peace the fuck off. <laughs> Same thing with the bear, <laughs> dude. I'll be honest with me, do you think this size is like big? Uh, yeah, I think that's ginormous. Really? For like a- like a nail. Yeah. Like, is that what you're talking about? Like, just like a nail size? Yeah. I think that would do some damage. <laughs> you think so? You could really do some damage with okay. that size of a nail. I was just wondering. Yeah. <laughs> That was sick. Oh, That's great, guys. Dude, limbo, limbo, limbo. I can't do this, man. I can't. Looks like uh, we found our campsite. And there's a waterfall and everything. You hear that waterfall? I hear a waterfall. <laughs> this is not too bad. <laughs> Gotta get to the other side where that sunset is. I wanna see the sunset. Hey! Ow! Whoa! Hey, wallet! Oh, you bitch, that is mine. <laughs> what? No, this is the treasure we've been looking oh, for, is it? So we don't repeat the same video that we just did, uh, where we were walking through brush for like two hours. Should we just find a place to set up camp and then we'll check in later? Yeah, it got dark so fast here in Montana. So fast, look, it's full moon. I don't know if you guys can see that. Yeah. The okay. riverbank is right here. We've been walking along this edge. So yeah, game plan is we're gonna try to find some flat land and we're gonna set up. And what sucks the most is like, we've been hearing coyotes. What do they sound like? Oh! Don't fucking do that the first time. Stop. Fuck that. Yeah, actually, we probably shouldn't do that anymore because it. <gasps> oh, oh, fuck! Fuck! <laughs> anyway, you hear them? That is definitely like yeah, dogs or coyotes. Them. You hear them. You hear them clearly. Those are not dogs, dude. That's some fucking rabbit dog. Is that I hope that in, in coyote language, I hope he said, fuck off, rather than like, come here. You know what I'm saying? You know? <laughs> Before we got here, we, we re researched this area, and especially during like these times, right before hibernation, like there's a ton of bears right around here, including like also like other coyotes and so other random sketchy. animals. <laughs> and the the guys on the boats just said that it's like deer mating season, so they're gonna be like running back and forth all over this, these yeah. prairies. It's like deer highway, and we're right in the middle of it. So we're gonna be in deer fuck lane. Yeah. Deer fuck lane. Deer fuck lane. <laughs> Coyote group. Orgy. Party. Orgy. And then like bear. <laughs> That's what I'm fucking talking no. about, dude. That's, so close. That's, so close. That's cool. That's too close, dude. That's a huge pass. That's right there. Dude, that's like 50. Okay, we, should we should move. We should go. Yeah, we should go this way. 
Dude, I swear to God. We gotta go that way. It's right there. That's a pack. It's behind. But the river's right there. So are they gonna cross the river? They're not gonna. Oh, you're right. But well, that means that's oh they, my they, fucking they god! Have really close, bro. They might have heard our like, like yelling, and they're running like. Let's get it! There's a whole pack. There's like. <laughs> Dude, we need to keep fucking walking. That's the closest I've heard them actually. I fucking hate that. Are we sure they're not gonna like attack us? No joke. I don't know. That one sounded like world. a human. That other one was like. <laughs> <laughs> Obviously, dude, they're howling like a motherfucker now. I hear them that way, and now I hear them this way. They are surrounding us. Yeah! 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 Keep that as a- Alright, never mind. Fuck the weapon. <laughs> Don't need it. It hits a coyote and a whole pack of <laughs> like, hey, you want to be sleeping on this with you? Dude, we're sleeping over Come here, on, Colby. Yeah. Dude, you're dual fisting <laughs> it. I'm scared. I just got <laughs> Wait, I think Cool, those are the steaks. Do you got steak? Yes, and chicken. <laughs> I know. And, and lamb chops. What do you want? And coyote meat. Oh, dude, I can't even Google. What are you gonna Google? What are coyote? Yeah, can coyote do coyotes eat humans for fun? <laughs> I was literally wanna Google that. Terrified. Oh. Let's go, Crosby. Crosby, let's go, dude. Look at your eyes, brother. You're fing scared. I was filming and everyone was having fun in front of me, but like behind me was just darkness. You see the horror in your I eyes. Something, dude. I have to admit, my ass is really warm. Why? Can you show me why? Yeah, look. Like... <laughs> <laughs> oh, 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 oh. My God. Nice. Guys, did we just make a fucking tent? Nice. Uh -huh. Nice. Yeah. I'm scary because I I rather hear them from a distance and not hear them at all. True. What if they're fucking creeping up on us right now? They like, could be. Right they literally could be. This is fucking scary. Yeah. <laughs> There's no doggy door. I'm gonna sleep both eyes open like this. <laughs> dude, zip up. Dude, this is nice. Dude, we should take the splash guard off. I want to see the Starry Starry Night by John Blazinski. <laughs> Who painted the Starry Night? Van Gogh. Van Gogh. We need to all howl at the moon. No. And then you and then you go. Yeah, we have to howl at the full moon, dude. But you have to get on all fours and do it. Yeah, and then I'm scared that. to howl again. That was a stupid idea. That scared the fuck oh, out of me. Stupid idea. Okay, what are we gonna do? Let's uh, summon some spirits. Is right, that what we're let's here to? Fucking not do that. How about that? We, then we have spirits and coyotes. <laughs> and there is spirits and coyotes already. Definitely. It's haunted in here. Remember? You already summoned in, in this tent. It's no, already. in this forest. One bro. of us is haunted. One in four people are haunted. <laughs> <laughs> no, actually, he's right. There are a lot of ghost stories. We actually like found this one. Love it! Can't wait to hear it. We've summoned the coyotes already right, with the howl. Now the you're gonna summon the ghost things. Wait, let's summon the ghost. Everyone, hold hands. Can we skip the ghost time story? Yeah, fuck it. Let's no, go outside. dude. What? I want to be scared. Dude, I just want to go pet the coyotes. No, JC's the. I want to go to scared. bed. I don't know why I'm so scared, but I am. Alright, so we know from like the museum and Peter that this whole area is haunted because of all the deaths that happen around here. Obviously, as you guys know, in the Custer's like last battle of Little Bighorn, like it just went horribly wrong. Now, there's a lot of soldiers that like didn't actually want to go into the battle because they knew they were going to die and lose. There was this one soldier that was trying to flee was going to turn his back on like all of his comrades. He wanted to go to the river so he could finally escape. Obviously, it's like treason of war. And by the time he hit the river, he got shot in the back and died. He never knew, though, if that was from a Sioux warrior or from one of his own comrades for basically disobeying. Yeah. So because of his That's guilt and because of his like <clears throat> the betrayal, he is deserting this land, like just finding his way, because he did never made it to like heaven or hell. Like he's roaming the, yeah, he's roaming these, ro part. roaming oh. around. That sounds like a whistle, Whoa. like a human whistle. Whoa! Oh, there is again. That's a whistle. That's not. That's a 
That's a whistle? That is not an animal. What is that? That sounds like a scream. Yeah, he's going Shh. <laughs> That's like a bird, I think. I'm just trying to make myself feel better, no joke. Should we go check? No. Yeah. No. <laughs> the fuck? I think it'd be fun to go explore. Didn't we come here to explore well, the haunted it's land? It's actually exactly 11. We came here to find treasure, dude. Well, then let's go fucking find it. Wait, that sounds like a scream, actually. That it sounds, sounds like, like a, a fucking, fucking pterodactyl. Scream. What is that? It's trying dude. to con like contact us. Let's go find it. Okay, we'll go this way, you guys that way. All right, let's split up. Y'all three go one way, I'll go the other by myself. <laughs> oh my God. Is it gazelle? We just leave him. Let's run the other way. Turn off the lights, turn off the lights. Fuck, he found us. Oh, you guys were trying to run oh, away from me? What? I want. <laughs> it's his phone. Wait, that's my phone. That's my fucking Damn, phone. Dude, dude imagine. Horrible. I don't know if we're gonna find anything, dude, but I think we should just like walk around if we're We can see if this place is haunted. Yeah. Let's see if we hear any other noises, but I don't I haven't heard the coyotes in a little bit. Yeah, I just heard that loud large scream. Yeah, that's about it. But yeah, maybe if like those woods are haunted, we can actually just walk around and see if we can What? Oh no. Dude, this is giving me witches for us vibes. Let's get out of here. Oh, fuck, guys. Dude. That's Holy shit, that's before. so close. You hear me? Oh, are we sure we're Should we go? I don't know if we're actually like that. That's really. Holy yeah. fuck, maybe we should wow. go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Let's go. Where? Where oh, are we going? I'm just saying, like, oh, the opposite oh, direction of all those things. Oh, I don't want to be a coyote. Dude, the fucking coyote. Holy fuck. What the fuck is this? We need to get it more far away from these coyotes. I feel like they, no matter where we go, they're going to be faster than us, right? But they were so... Much closer that second Dude, that, time. That one was scary. That was very close. Wait, guys. I don't think we went towards the river. What do you mean? Wait, wasn't the river to the left? No, I think it's the right. It was always to a right, right? No, 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 because we, we started like our tent was on the right, so it had to be to the left. Right? No, but when we set up our tent, it was behind us. It was to the right of the river, I believe, right? Fuck, dude. I'm, oh, God. Let's just find the river and then we'll be able to get our way back. But we des definitely need to keep our distance until those coyotes go away. Okay, well, where do you think it is? Well, what's there? There was a path by the river, so let's just try to find a path. Yeah, but this is like the worst fucking thing we could do if we don't have any fucking service. We need to stop being so careless and like treat this video seriously. Do we think the fuck was that? What? Huh. I heard like a... <sighs> Where's JC? I hate you. Wait, wait, is that... What if the coyotes come from that way too? But is that, is that the guy? Stop, bro. No, no, I'm not saying like, like a spirit. I'm saying is that an actual guy? Hello? Holy fuck! Wow. Holy fuck! As soon as you said hello, there was a scream. No lie, that is on camera, 100%. Oh, wait, wait, here's the path. And that's the river. How long do you think we ran? We ran a fucking marathon, dude. I swear to God, we've heard coyotes, a fucking guy screaming over on that side. Yeah, I heard the scream from over there. Hello? Hmm. 
That was so weird. I literally, I heard the, the like the breathing, and then I heard a dude's voice over there, and then JC was like, "Hello," and there's a scream, like an actual yeah. scream, and that all happened within 30 seconds. Like, and all the coyotes. What, what are you heard. talking about? Like the one dude that haunted the place too. Yeah, that one well, soldier. Yeah, the soldier that like haunts this place. I don't know if that was him. I think that was someone like real. It was like danger. That scares me more. Do we know if anybody like actually owns this land? Like, what if we're on like? Yeah, no. I th well, I think a lot of people. Different people why would there owns be a this. Right here? Well, that's right. what I'm saying. It's like someone definitely owns this land. We're somewhere on the river, so one way is better than just not going anywhere. Wait, tons of barbed wire. That means we made it onto like someone's definite land. Yeah. Keep going. Let's keep going, but let's just not go over the fences. You know, I'm still worried about bears more than anything. Dude, yeah, look how big this is. This is definitely like a path, so we might be able to find something here. It almost looks like a road. Look, 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 you see that light? Way, In way, way yeah. Way, yeah. Oh, that's right. All the way over there. Do you see that? Yeah. There's some, yeah, right there. You can see it through the bushes. But there's some sort of housing over there. So I guess that's a good sign. Holy fuck, holy fuck, holy fuck, holy fuck. Holy shit. All right, guys. Update. We just heard gunshots. We just heard fucking gunshots. What the fuck was that? I just like branch that fell over. No, I, I, that was not on camera, but that was like, do, 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 like right next to us. What the fuck was that? But if it's gunshots, then we should leave. I have no idea what that was. I don't was. care. That was too real. Dude, that was the scariest sound I've ever heard since filming. You just ever. keep everything rolling at this point, no joke. Yeah. We were right there, and then it happened like right there. Holy shit! Was that one of you guys? Did you hear like a stick crack? After or before like that rock? Just now. No. I heard a stick crack right over there. Like... Okay, maybe we should go back. Maybe back towards the river. Try to get back to the tent maybe. Get a game plan. Yeah, if it wasn't this way, then it'd have to be this way, right? What? Remember being in this tall grass? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, yeah. I think it's like actually right over here. Okay, sick. Yeah, because it wasn't Thank like God. that tall over there. Dude, we were looking for our tent for so fucking long. It's definitely over here. Right here? I literally... No. Fuck. What? Dude, everything looks the same. What? Yeah, no, it was... I swear. God damn it. Wait, Wait yeah, is this... it in here? It... No. In... Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right here. Right here? Oh, it's oh, not fuck. here either, dude. Oh, no. Where the fuck oh, is fuck. it? Because I thought this place looked identical. Wait, are we actually like... No. Oh, why? Actually, zero bars. Zero, zero bars. Power? Completely out. And it's almost midnight. Oh, my fuck. 15 we, minutes. We yeah. actually need to get oh, back. Cold, bro. Okay, let's... Yeah, it's going to get colder and colder, too. Okay, let's keep no, going. We don't know where we no, are. We, we do. It has to be like right here, dude. It was in this grass, though, for sure. Remember, like, yeah. building it on, like, all of It this. has to be around here. Oh, my God. Oh. Fuck. Oh my we made a wrong turn somewhere. Does this make wrong turn? We just, like, went back the other way. We didn't go that far running from these, like, coyotes. I just can't believe this is the second time we got lost in the forest. What do we do? Second time. I mean, it's a lot easier now because we don't have any service at all. What the fuck is that? It's a dodge. I hope they pick that up. Do you hear that? Wait, that's a big growl. Is that getting closer? What the fuck is that? Is that wind? That can't be wind. That's like really noisy wind, but it's not windy. What could I have that been? It up. No, I 
definitely that could have been on there. Okay, let's pick away in the lock. Let's just keep going this way, right? Mm-hmm. Never out in the open bushes like this. True. I feel like we're going inland. Yeah, though. guys, we're going in circles. We got to Are we? We're dude, 100. percent We're we're going in circles. Do we recognize any of this? And where's the where's the river? No, Do we lose the river again? This is too open. There's no, we didn't walk through this. This is too like, it's like a parking lot. Yeah, what are you doing, about to throw up? No. Are you tired? No, I'm just like, winded? No. You pissed me? off? You hate us? No, I don't hate you, bro. Whoa. What? They're, they're there again, they must be like that way. Do you hear that? Let's just not go that way. Dude, huh? they're first that way and now they're fucking that way. We have to go this way, dude. I'm not walking back into coyotes. This looks familiar. Dude, this full moon looks so horrifying. Dude, this looks so much like our campsite. Like the low grass, the brush on the sides, like I swear to God, this is like the spot. How long have we been lost? What time is it now? It's, pro- it's probably been like 20 minutes, not yeah, bad, 30 minutes. 12. But like still, I don't want to be out here for like an hour being lost. So we know we saw lights this yeah. one, right? Well, we saw lights for like houses. Uh, what? I found it. No! No, you fucking didn't. <laughs> Where? Oh my god. Where are you? Oh. oh my god, hallelujah. Holy fuck. Oh shit. Oh, thank the Lord, man. We are not thank leaving. The oh. like a, there's a bear in it. <laughs> <laughs> we come back. Yeah, we were giving up. There's a whole oh, like so coyote pack. On the fucking ground, dude. dude. We were gonna about to walk seven miles Almost towards probably. a light I, I in the distance. Bro, I wish upon something, and this came true. What did you wish upon? Finding the damn tent. Did you wish upon a shooting star? No. We okay. Well, what are we doing now? Just sleeping? Uh, we're we're definitely not, we not splitting up and exploring. Yeah, whose idea was that? Yaws. Oh yeah. Oh my god, guys. I don't know what you're doing. in here, dude. I don't know what you're doing. This is my bed, guys. This is my side. You got your bed? Yeah, this is walking to my room, guys. Five star hotel. Honestly, I've never been more happy to be in a tent. Honestly, where are you going to sleep, Sam? There's like no room for you. What the fuck? Why are you guys taking up all the room? Honestly, I'm a pretty big boy. We big boys. Today was good. Thanks for getting us lost. Summoning fucking demons. Thank you, Sam. Summoning bears. Summoning wolves. Hey, Sam. Thank you, Summoning Sam. Summoning coyotes. Welcome, guys. Ready for bed, man. Real life bumming it. <laughs> guys, there's not even Wi-Fi here. So dude. what are you doing on your phone, Sucks, dude. Kobe, what are you Honestly, editing pocket? a picture. Wow. <laughs> I'm editing my picture. That's a wow. But the sunset is beautiful, okay? <laughs> Kobe's holding the flashlight in his pocket. He's rubbing it against me. No, I'm not. What type of flashlight? <laughs> <laughs> like and subscribe. Dude, what are you itching over there? What are you doing? I'm itching my poison ivy arms, like, bro. Poison she ivy arms, it. sure. We don't know what you're doing underneath <laughs> there. Colby, can you effing relax, I dude? I'm just relaxed, <laughs> itching my poison ivy arms. It's time for bed. I want bed by time. Can you guys tell me a bedtime story? Pretty please. Pretty, pretty oh, please. Oh, Once upon a time, there's two kids. And they don't believe in compasses, and they get lost in the forest multiple times. And they invited other two kids. Yeah. And those two kids are cute. One of them's really cute. One of them's cuter than the other, though. I like that story. All right, guys. The end. Good night. I'll see (laughs) you guys tomorrow morning. (laughs) Bye.
hear the yelling? No. Quiet. He did it that 100% like wasn't like an animal. I didn't hear it. No. It sounded like two guys yelling. Now what could that possibly be other than guys then? No, no one should be up. Unless there's like hunters. Do you think there's hunters? I think hunters like go through the night. Are we in okay area? This is private land, I think. Wait. What was that? Did you hear that? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That was like a creek. Should we get out of here? I think we're better like staying put. Oh god, okay. It's the sunrise, bro. Five a.m. Exactly afternoon. Let's all, all give morning faces. See how we look. Beautiful. Dude, <laughs> I look like shit. Half the fucking night, I woke up like three times, <laughs> just to like turn over, and Colby's like, yeah. <gasps> <laughs> <laughs> yes, you were. <laughs> the entire night, I was like that. I was like by my. You guys feet. are like making out. Like, I got so, hurt. You were by your feet. <laughs> I was like that far in my sleeping bag. So what happened to the twelve person tent? That's what I want to know. <laughs> you know. Tricked us, guys. What's the point of going on a treasure hunt when you can't get close with your friend? It's like an elevator. You know how it says capacity is like sixty. But really, you can only fit like 12 people in there. Probably fit 12 in here, but it ain't gonna feel great. What's uh, the plan now? Dude, I'm I don't know. We gotta get out of here. Guys. Get some warmth. Heading out. Goodbye, big old forest. We're gonna go explore more. I know we had a bad la night last night, getting lost a little bit, but this is beautiful morning. True, yeah. What time is it? I'd much rather be here than Los Angeles. It's like nine. Wait, 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 I don't know. It, it was. I, I saw two people. We're on like private land. Do you do you think that's like the owner of the land? I don't know. I don't even know if they saw us yet. Okay. So what do we do? I think we just start sneaking slowly that way. Oh, you have like the worst plans ever, always. The river we were talking about yesterday. Yeah, yeah buddy. The river. Yeah, this has got to be like. Public land right here. Not many more. I have no what idea. What are you guys doing out there? Ghostly bodies. Wait, 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 wait. He said. Go. Hello? Yeah. What are you guys doing? Sam, go talk to him, please. Uh, we're just, we're just camping. We're filming just for YouTube. What are you guys filming? We're just out here treasure hunting. We're not like trying to do anything bad or trespass or anything. Uh, yeah, yeah, we, we, uh, we heard that there might be treasure out here, so we're trying to just explore the land over here. Sorry if this is you guys'. Well, Welcome to the KRC Ranch, by the way. Yeah, thank you. We uh, actually bought this place about four years ago. This is 28 acre ranch and we're both uh, disabled veterans. So right now we are retired and we're actually trying to turn this ranch into a, um, like a respite for uh, disabled veterans and, and other veterans so that um, they can come out here and disabled veterans will free of charge be able to come out and and camp out here on our property. We've got is there a that... lot of hunting going on everywhere? Oh yeah, and it's not just deer and, and bear and what, we don't, we haven't seen an elk out here, but no. but a lot of geese. I mm. mean, our right. yard is- Last night, no. Yeah, dude. We got woken up by them, actually. At a certain time of the year, they have a, a coyote hunt where you can get into teams 
and bring in the most weight and most uh, coyotes. Last night we would have made a killing. <laughs> they were like 12 feet behind <laughs> us. Dude, there's like so many. Seven. There's a bunch and we've had them up close to the house. Right where the dogs had just been, we saw like three coyote right there. So right where we were camping pretty much. No, yeah, right here. So it was like, <laughs> oh, oh Lord. God. We've lived here about four years now and we've heard stories. We've been down to the museum and we've heard stories about the Grant Marsh legend. Exactly what we're looking for. That's what we need. Yeah. <laughs> I hear conflicting stories and you guys, you know, have been down to the river and the river banks have changed just in the four years we've lived here. Oh, and it's really? and it's moved. So, you know, you hear from the old timers, oh, my favorite one is, you know, oh, I know where it's at. I'm the only one here that knows where it's really at. You'll hear them say that. And why don't they have the gold? Yeah. I know. Exactly. <laughs> exactly. And I mean, there's so many rumors. And one of the rumors is it's already been found. Somebody hit. I don't know. I can't imagine that one guy would come here camping and be able to. Um, Take all that gold back with him. Yeah, I might be able to get one gold bar in my pocket and carry it out, and that's about it. If someone found it, there's probably still more there. Oh, oh I yeah. Well, they rehit it. But the legend is that Grant Marsh never did come back to pick it up. You don't know if someone came back. There's no documentation from anything back then. We don't know who was actually on the boat with him. If it was buried like on the side of the river and with all the erosion and stuff, it, it's not gonna move, but it could be under, you know, 20 feet of, of gravel now. And you think like this might be like close to it? I mean, obviously there's a bunch of different legends, but is there any legend of it being right here? Yes and no. They they talk about in one of the legends, it's between eight and nine miles out from where it it merges with the Little Bighorn. Yeah. Most of the legends talk about him fighting with the army uh, commander that was on the boat about where they really were. Well, if they didn't know oh, where wow. they were, how do they know where the gold is? Exactly. You know. They talk about a ridge with pine trees. That whole ridge line right there, and it goes all the way over closer to the river over there. It took them three and a half hours to get from where they were on the, the boat to take the gold, three and a half hours, to this pine ridge. Is that they found a cave, they put it in the cave, and they used their shovels or axes or whatever to close the opening of the cave. How many pounds was that? How many people did he take? Did they have horses? The more and more you guys talk about this, the more and more I think it's just like right literally there. on your property. Yeah. <laughs> your property need, might like get a gold metal mine. scanner. You guys have a metal detector? No. no. We were gonna get one though. We, we wanted one. Can't oh. take it on the plane. I got one. You guys can use it. You have one? Yeah. Check that. I, it might not be real gold. All right, what'd you buy me? <laughs> oh, you could put it, yeah, you could put it to uh They could have a metal detector. Foil. So we're gonna search the entire land for gold right now? What's I have a, I have a gold nugget it? in this bear. <laughs> <laughs> Wait, I'll find some. I just find the buried treasure of... In their front yard. <laughs> Dude, start digging. Right there. <laughs> right yard. We're all laughing, dude. That could be his buried treasure. <laughs> Boom. It could be. What do, you, what do you think the probability is to actually find anything or a treasure? Let's say the probability of the, 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 the gold being on their land is 1%, even if, and then they have 28 acres. That would take us, you know, a week. We need to find our fucking car, dude. I want to change into a green well, we shirt. We know where Me our car too. is. Yeah, we know where it's at the fishing spot. So yeah, but where are we now? At the if, well, that, 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 that we, we don't know. How do we tell them, hey, we're at this, uh, we just went to the river. Like, oh, I know where that is. Let's go. We, we can go. call a cab. We don't have service. <laughs> Every Yo, we're going to ask these nice people to give us a ride back to our spot. <laughs> JC says we have to do this. I don't want to do it anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Here it is. Let's get a replay. This is my brand. Watch out, Kobe. Watch out. Alrighty, guys. We're going to chug this fucking beer, all right? I think this will give us energy in order to find gold, because the beer is gold. Beer is gold, so we'll good luck. Oh, oh fuck, <laughs> Chug it, 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 oh shit. I'm the designated metal detector, so I can't be chugging no beers. 
All right, so supposedly this piece of land right here has a lot of items that we might be able to find with that metal detector and that and dog. They said even if we don't find gold, but they tend to like dump a lot of things in these like little drifts and ridges and whatnot. So we might be able to find some other treasure. Hey, uh, I guess we'll find out. Guys, this is our brand. Yeah, what's this is that? our brand. That's y'all's brand. Wow, look at the difference. One can find the uh, choose can choose your the choose other. your fighter, guys. Yeah, if See, you had to, that's if, why we're better together because we need those things. You keep saying better together. It's dude, it's like clicking. It sounds super good. Can you guys see it on a shirt? Better to are we better together? Better together, like a brand name? Oh yeah. 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 Hell yeah. We going, baby. So Sam, do you think we're gonna find something? We haven't found that much this trip, so now would be the time. Fingers crossed. I want an inkling over here. Yeah. <sighs> Dude, yeah. Earlier you were talking about uh, the ridge of like where the treasure could be. Are you talking about that big mountain range over there? Yeah. Wow. But it comes, it goes all the way over. Like how many acres of land could that even be? That's insane. For eight miles, treasure could literally be anywhere. Seriously, no wonder it hasn't been found yet. It could be absolutely anywhere. Someone could have found it already. Like they said there are legends that other people have found it. And like she said, like if somebody did find the gold, they might not cash it all in at once or like tell people, wait, there's a hole. It's in there. It's in there. Oh! Sam, you're lying. What? No fucking way. Wait, what is? No way. It's a sewage drain. Oh man, of course. Big metal pipe. Damn, I got so excited. I got me excited. I was like, what? I know. A hole? It's like so perfect. <laughs> Did you guys find anything? Hey, yeah, we found something in that hole. No, you Show didn't. Him, Sam. There's actually something in there. <laughs> We're not having very much luck, are we? Yeah, they said metal detecting would be best in this little ridge, but they also said a lot of the time they'll just find like random objects or horseshoes or anything like that just out on this prairie. Yeah, like not even digging or so, looking at all. We're gonna try doing that, try finding a couple other areas. As of right now, it's not looking good for us treasure hunters. Yeah, I guess we uh, walk back towards uh, her car and then um, hope for the best. Wait! Are you fucking with us? No. Is it a wire? It's not a wire. Bottle cap? It's actually like a ball. Wait! Like an acorn? Like a rock? What's that? Wait, no, you oh, actually shit. found something? <laughs> what? Wait, what is that? It's like a metal nut. Well, you're fucking oh putting it on your head face? That's nuts, dude. Wait, oh shit, this is heavy. That's pretty, yeah, yeah that's pretty hefty. Thing. Holy shit. Oh, dude! That's Wait. pretty good find. No, you didn't. Thanks, guys. Whoa! It's like a Wait. little, it's like a little small mini cannonball. Yeah. Holy shit! Oh shit! Do you that was actually like think it was the Cold War or something? Probably. We found something. Yeah, we actually oh, found oh, something. No, it's like heavy. We're sitting out here going like, we're what never if, gonna fucking I find no. anything. Yeah, what if this is the treasure and it's just worth nine million dollars? It could be. That's all. Not, that's all. Eight hundred thousand dollars just compacted into one. <laughs> like it, just it just melted down. Mm -hmm. What? What actually? Be would that be? Because that's not like a. It's like a, a, can, it's like a an cannonball, old right? Ass avocado. It looks like. <laughs> but it's not the but way. Like I wish you guys can feel it. I wish this video was four D. Is it metal? Oh yeah, I guess. Absolutely. So. Oh. It's tough. I don't think it's a rock. It's too perfect to be a rock. Look at that. You can't do it on my veneers. <laughs> Dude, what a find! What the hell? Dude, nice find. JC, the oh, yeah. JC. Dude, found like uh, two fucking sewage drains and this. Let's go. Yeah, so I'm the I'm the real fucking explorer. I found the bob wire. Oh, look at that. It almost looks rusty, but it's not. Yeah, definitely old, but like mm -hmm. that's like nice. a three-inch cannonball, or you know. Yeah. Yeah. A cannonball. I didn't know those were metal, though. Yeah. Oh my god. That's super strange. Oh yeah. It's big Fuck enough yeah. to take someone's legs out. Oh yeah, if this came at you at 100 miles an hour, you're, you're done for, 100%. <laughs> it's on your property though, you guys can keep it. Cool. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, 
All right, well, thank you guys so much for, you know, being so nice. I know we were just randomly camping on your, your land, but. Uh, it happens, so. it's okay. <laughs> just no one else. No. Yeah, no one else, yeah. If you guys want to support their ranch, again, the link down below will be super nice if you guys semi-successful with uh, the, the metal detecting and all that, so. Hey, I feel like that cannonball was a success. I don't even know if it was a hundred percent. What's up guys, so as you can see, we are in a hotel room. We're all showered and changed and everything. Um, the lady at KRC Ranch was nice enough to drive us back to our rental car, and then we drove. Place. Yeah, sorry. <laughs> and then we were able to come all the way back to Billings and get a hotel. So we've talked to a ton of different people about this whole treasure hunting thing. We've learned a lot about the story, a bunch of different legends, and even as the KRC Ranch people put it, there are a ton of different stories that all go throughout this treasure. I know in Cerro Gordo, our last treasure hunting series, we did find quite a bit, mm -hmm. and on this one we didn't find as much, but we still found a couple cool things. Obviously, treasure hunting, especially when it being 200 years old, is gonna be up and down. <laughs> But at the same time, these are gonna lead to like crazy adventures. Like we've never magnet fished. We've never been to Montana at never. all. Like yeah. we met JC. so many cool people on the way. Yeah, and like there, there's no way Ken and JC have ever like treasure hunted like this. And not to be cheesy, but like we bonded with Ken and JC a lot this trip as well. Just having like two, three days just to do our own thing and like have an adventure together. When's Sick. the last time like we camped in 30 degree weather? That's what I'm saying. Know? It was like Boy Scouts for me. So yeah, like, we want to continue doing these treasure hunting trips all over the world. I mean, hey, maybe one day we will find the real pot of it, but obviously <laughs> it's just about the adventure. So if you have other YouTubers that want to go check out some treasure, tag them below. Or you could text us right here. We've been texting a lot of you guys back as much as we can, so let us know right here. Text us who we should bring next. On the texting platform, we, we give away a lot of stuff like merch and like random gifts, and we also have like a bunch of secret projects that we only do on the texting community, so it also is worth it other Don't than just out. giving suggestions. Also, if you guys really are enjoying these treasure hunting series, like this video right Right now, let's see if we can get 200,000 likes. 200,000 likes. The only way we know if you want to continue seeing these treasure hunting videos is if you like the video. Like, we're only going to do the stuff that you guys like. So exactly. come on. Let us know. Let us know. Smash it. Let's do it. Uh, we have one night left, and we really want to always bring back the abandoned explore days. It'll be a whole different like vibe to Montana. Like we've been out in the rural area of like crazy treasure hunting, yes. and now we're gonna be into the abandoned buildings again. So yeah. Really you guys remember a long, long time ago we collabed with our friend Dan. He's actually from Montana, and because we've had you know ups and downs like this last like day looking for treasure, we wanted to just like call and ask him, and he actually has some great suggestions for like abandoned locations. Where do you think we should go if we got an extra f one one free night in Montana? A couple of spots actually that come to mind are out in this tiny little town called Buffalo, Montana. Like an abandoned school and actually an abandoned bank. Apparently back in the 20s, they had a big drought, so it kind of killed the, the agriculture industry out there. And that's why the bank shut down and everything because uh, no one had any money and so the, the bank was kind of unused. So it's so just kind of like these two buildings, the people just kind of up and left and now it's just sitting there? Yeah, exactly. I know like a couple of our videos uh, were like right before we stopped doing the whole banner thing for other reasons. Uh, do you think we're gonna get right. caught if we go there? I, w I would say no. You're in the middle of nowhere. Should should be very low risk. Like, it's four and it's us. So we're coming up on this ghost town called Buffalo, and I think there's only a few people that live here that guard the town. It's a small ass ghost town. You have to be a ghost to live. Way oh, sorry, bro. Yeah, you have to be a ghost to live here, apparently. Children oh, wait, have to There's a fucking coyote. Damn, it's like a town of three people. Look at the moon. We're about to double their population right now. Oh, wait. You see that car? Dude, even these houses right here look scary. Why is there someone there? Oh no. Wait, yeah, it looks like there's some sort of car right it's like there. A city, but it's Holy shit. Dude. Oh my fucking. Dude, what the that fuck? giant building. Yeah, 
think that's, that, that fucking truck is terrifying. All of it. It's, it's a, a trailer. It looks it's like a, a set truck. It's a mobile home. It's like all abandoned. But there's still like two people here. It's scary. They can kill you and nobody will be able to find us. Yeah. Dude, it's a full moon tonight too. Yeah. Now we're looking up towards this right. bank yeah. in front of us. Oh, right there's oh a little God. hole, bro. Dude, that's gonna be oh, so fuck. scary. Hello? Bank says hello back. <laughs> yeah, there might be fucking people in here, numb nuts. Okay, and then what? They're gonna come out and kill us, so we leave. Dude, sure this is gonna be this? scary as Dude, fuck. they already sold our car. Like, everybody that lives in the town knows there was somebody. Three people. Nobody comes out here, so they already know there's somebody, like, watching. Yeah, but you know okay, so think about it. If you lived in a random house and you saw a car pull up and hop in a, in a abandoned building right next to you, would you go after them? Mm, no, scary. not really. Exactly, so I think... These if, guys think different, though, dude. We're in the middle of, like, no I'm just scared there's someone in there. Like, that's someone's home somehow. That's why I, I said mean, hello, and you're like, you fucking banks yeah, but you think they're, they're, <laughs> they're gonna come out and be like... Hey. We've done this for like a year and a half, and this is like one of the sketchiest things we've done. That's amazing. Really? Yeah, that's Why amazing. Would you glad you brought us. Because there's literally like people. five people here, so they all know we're here. And it's Montana, and they all can carry guns. And like, if we actually got hurt, it's like, who are we going to call? Ghostbusters. I think people are going to come and talk. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, what? And they're like, what's going on there? Well, what did they shoot us? Friend say? He only went outside of them. He also went what? in 2017. He went three years ago. Why are we here? We drove two hours to get here. We have to go and do it. Let's go. The first bank. And that's the only way in, huh? I'm guessing it's a Oh, fuck. The uh, first middle? and only bank of Buffalo. I'm going in the middle. I'm not what did you guys have to do to get? Sam is last because he has to follow us. What the fuck? I'm going right, to be out here alone? Fuck, dude. We're going to have to go in there? Oh, my God. Oh, God. Dude. Oh, God. This is going to be bad. Dude. Oh, I see a safe. No way. A safe. Wait, what? <gasps> Did you hear that? Safe? Okay, let's go. 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 Getting let's silent go. Like that. I'm just saying, let's go. Who's going in Dang first? It. No one's home. Guys, it's locked. We have to go home. It would be scary as if we all had to run out and like the worst part would be all of us trying to get out and having to wait for someone to be like this. Oh, I think there's a <laughs> God damn it. We don't have time. <laughs> you got Oh, you do Jesus you Christ. <laughs> No! You're no, like, no! No! I did paper! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh, fuck. Dude, you lost like five times! No! Rock, paper, scissors, shoot! Oh, no! It's five out of seven! No. Jesus Christ, go, go, go! Holy oh, fuck! Ow! Fuck! This is the longest time it's ever taken us to get inside of an abandoned place. You fucking know. do it then, dude. This is scary, man. My teeth are chattering. This is making me, like, have gas. Can I fart on camera? Yes. He got so fucking quiet. That's a nervous fart, bro. <laughs> <laughs> so pathetic. Let's go, let's go, let's go, let's go. Should we just go now? Yeah, let's go. We're getting, we're getting. There's <laughs> fucking bones in here, bro. No, no there not. aren't. There's bones? I'll start beginning. Oh shit, dude! Ah, there's a bones. shoe and bones. What the oh fuck? my god, what the Is hell? That more bones right there? Like a deer leg or something. You guys are scary. My fucking heavy ass is gonna fall through the floor. I feel. Like. <laughs> what? My fuck. That's what I'm saying. Is it? Is there a basement? Oh, there is a basement. You getting stuck down there? Stop, Just bitch! <laughs> oh my god, Sam, dude. Oh. Is it Ethan? Oh, I thought... It's a cock ring. Is this an elevator? Oh my god. What is... Is that the basement? That's not how you get to the basement, but yeah. There's definitely something down here. Dude, it's all caving in. There's an animal living down here. Shit. Listen. Yeah, it's pretty scary. What's that? Oh, what the f... Sorry. People used to come in here and, like, do business, dude. Like, years and years and years ago. Yeah. And now it's just... Is it burnt? What do you think it is? Burnt down or just like, what happened? Yeah, what so think? like a hundred years ago, this was a town, but I think he was saying around 1920, there's a massive drought here. Is that a car right next to us? Yeah, dude. No one's supposed to be coming. Oh my god, dude! What the fuck? What the oh, fuck? Man. Are you okay? You okay? You okay? You okay? Holy shit! Oh my god, dude. Fell. You literally almost fell through. Just fell in the hole, bro. You just talked about that. Kian, do you see anything? Kian, are we 
Keen, okay. okay, is someone coming? Someone's coming down this way. I'll let you know if they turn down this way. Okay. Dude, you just almost fell through. Holy I know. fuck. I gotta be Guys, they're turning down this way. No, they're not. It's there. Fuck. Who's coming? Holy shit, dude. So much just happened in the last like five seconds. I fucking fell. My leg was in the basement for a little while. <laughs> he took the quickest trip to the basement. Through. Holy shit. Dude, you guys are on back. Dude, look at that. If I would have fell all the way in there, that could have been you, dude. Fuck that. Oh my god. Let's look at the safe. Holy shit. Just took all their money or something. This is so sick. Yo, we were looking for treasure. We found the safe. Maybe there's like some leftover dollar bills in here. You spelled oh. Did you hear that? Yeah. So I was right. I'm scared of these fucking floors now. Okay, let's make it quick in here. I heard a footstep, bro. Yeah. Where? That way. Fuck, I hate you guys. Why am I here? Oh my god. That's insane. Another fucking car. Really? Yeah. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god, dude. Holy shit. I know, you gotta be careful. Wait, wait. We should check if that actually like went into your fucking foot. It didn't. I, I would have felt it. Like, I, I felt a little bit, but it didn't go in my foot. Holy but, shit. No. What? What? That's outside. That's straight outside. If we could go around. See? Yeah. Shotgun shell. Really? Yeah. Whoa. That's not a good sign. not good at all. I say we get out of this place. This is dangerous. The fact that like JC almost fell through just makes me not want to be in this place. You just stepped on a nail. Stuck to your shoe for a bit. Say goodbye to the your leg right there, Jesus. He's sneaking out of an abandoned bank and he's taking a piss. <laughs> yeah, I feel dirty. Holy oh, shit, God. Dude. Are you okay though? No, no, I'm good. Okay. Oh my God. That's so Steve, but. That's, n oh, that's dude. Good. Yeah, I literally called it. I was like, my fat ass is gonna fucking fall through this shit. And that wasn't and just was gonna be like a like, two second fall, that was gonna be like 15 foot. Like that. Two cars passed and they didn't give a fuck about our car, so does that mean we're confident enough to go into this school? I'm so scared. <laughs> that light right next to the school. Okay, let's just do another round then. There's like a giant building too. Why would they just have a camper right next to that abandoned creepy building? A trailer, a camper, and a car. And there's a giant fucking animal running towards it right there. What do you mean animal? Yeah. Right there, see it? See it? Oh, what the fuck? What, what is, is that? that? Just There's a second one. What the oh, fuck is that? The raccoons. Can you see anybody? I can't see anybody. Guys, this is what we're trying to get into. Oh my god. What's that say? What school? Buffalo school. Oh, Buffalo god. school right there. I want to get in so fucking bad. I say like, we like kind of make a little this ruckus. Is, this is all fenced off. There's no way we should just go in. They'd fucking shoot us. Dude. Wait. What was that? Did you hear that? Yeah. Oh, wait. I just saw movement in the in the camper, I swear. Okay. Yeah, there's somebody looking out the window. Really? Yep. So we should say what's up? No. Dude, why, why, why? No, Colby, don't, don't Colby. Dude, we have to like say something. We'd much rather get on their side than be super sketch, right? Yeah, 100%. Maybe back up. Yeah, back up and like maybe flash your light. I saw a face appear and then like, like they saw us and like kind of ducked away fast. I just don't want to cross their property. Yeah. Without them knowing. Yeah, we should. I I'll, I feel like. It, what time is it? Like. Nine. It's only like. Yeah. Eight eleven. Eight eleven. Yeah. Oh, it's eight o'clock. We should. We could like just yell out though. That's definitely not gonna be. They're not gonna be asleep. Do you want to just be like hello? Why are we going so yeah, slow? Yeah, slow. <laughs> you want to go? Go. Just go back right here. 
and let's shine all of our flashlights at the school and then be like, hello. Is there an easy way in? Is that front door open? Front yeah. door is completely open. Yeah, so it's not, it. not like we'd have to like worry about them. Hello? Hello? Fucking Sam, dude. Imagine being the only ones out here and then all of a sudden you just hear someone screaming hello at you. That's fucking scary. I'd be scared. I'd be scared. Do you want to know why they're, I guess this is their like residential area? Like, this is. They have the school fenced off and they're sleeping right next to it. Yeah, but they're. They're it, the Are oh. you sure though? It's like. I'm not sure, but. They're like, fenced in. I feel like at a school, you, you don't just own a school. Holy oh, shit, dude. What's up, man? Hey, can we come in there? Hey, go get your owner. Hey, kitties. Listen. Are you going to let us inside? Are you going to maul me as soon as I cross the fence? If I go to the fence, all the cats are like, Did you get that full moon already? Because holy shit. That looks crazy. This is where we're at tonight. Yo, part of me says, like, we just fucking do it. I want to just do it too. I don't think they're going to come out. Like, if we were yelling at them and we were right here and they're not going to come out, they're not going to come out if we're in there, you know? I don't know why they wouldn't at least, like, pop their head out and be like, hello? Because, like, if we're definitely making enough of a statement out here with all these flashlights. And the engine, car engine, yeah. Hello? Fuck. I can't say that. Sam, you do it. You do it better. Can we wait, like, 10 seconds really quick? Did you ever, like, when you were a little kid, sit in the closet? Or is that just me? Just by yourself if you're in a quiet room? Yeah, like playing hide and seek or something. Yeah. It sounds like that where there's just like, it's so quiet. There's like that buzzing, like, you know what I'm saying? Okay, guys, we got 40% battery on this camera. And this is our last SD card of the trip. So we either make a move or we're going to run out anyway. This is the last thing we got to film. This is our last adventure of Montana. Hello? Actually, Kia knows how to whistle. <laughs> <laughs> what are you doing? There's a bullet coming flying. I want some protection. <laughs> we have a sniper pointing at us right now. Hello? Hey, I, I don't know if you guys can hear us. We're just going to, going to school real quick. And we'll be out. It's like 10 minutes. We mean no harm. We're just going to go in and out for a quick video. Sounds good to me. Let's go. <laughs> Sam, if I get shot, I'm taking the gun from them and shooting you. I see someone. Huh? Where? They're moving. What? Hello? They're moving. Where are you? you? see them? In that crack right there. That's what I was looking at. Yeah, yeah, they're moving the in the crack. Dude, that's so creepy that they're not. Why answering. aren't they answering, dude? Like, I'm going to wait till they jump that fence and I'm going to come out with my shotgun. True, yeah. I don't know how to make it more clear to them. What's going on? Okay, so I'm sketched the fuck out. <laughs> I am I am like 100% sketched out. Everyone's like, dude, let's just make a run for it. I was like, no, let's go knock on the door. Long story short, the house backed out a little bit, and I was like, why don't we just go knock on that person's house and ask them the deal about this? Be like, you know, is this guy fucking weird? Can we go on the property? Is anyone actually there? Blah, blah, blah. And if that doesn't work out, <laughs> we're just gonna have to go for it, dude. Yeah, we're a little sketched out. I think we should just bring this camera and this light. That house back there has lights on, so I think that's our best bet. Yeah, and that's like the only house around. That's like yeah. the only neighbor he or she has. Oh, that's so scary. That's the only. So, that's the only hope we have. Let's, I'm down to try. Because it'll at least give us more information about it. If she has no idea who this guy is. That's even creepier. But if she does, she's like, "Oh yeah, dude, Jim's super nice." Like, cool. Okay, I bet. Yeah. <laughs> Jim's super nice. She makes some sandwiches every week. <laughs> Let's start her up. <laughs> Hello. Hey, we're home. Hey, we just want to ask a question. There's a voice in there. Hello. Dude, this is fucking weird. Oh, hello. What's up? Uh, me and my buddies are trying to uh, just quickly take some pictures of this uh, school over here. Do you know if that guy owns the land right here? Yeah, I think he does. That guy in the RV? Yeah. Do you know him, perchance? I don't. Ah, because there's a fence there, but we're just going to take a few pictures. We're wondering if you think he would like mind, or have you ever seen him? I have never talked to him, really. Oh, really? Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you have to go over and ask him, I think. Okay, well, thank you. Yeah, thank you anyway. Sorry about that. Have a nice night. So, basically, he said we have to go up and ask this guy. Yeah, I heard. I better though, because if we get a response from this guy, like we get this guy, yeah. he'll probably be really cool. And it creeped me out when he didn't answer the question. I was like, dude, this is creepy vibes. Like, both TVs are on. 
not like quiet as hell. Oh, dude. oh my god. Oh fuck. Go ahead. Hello? Go Sam. You wanted to do it. How has he never talked to him? They live right next to each other. Well I guess we don't talk to him. That guy anymore. was like in his underwear too. We like probably scared the fuck out of him. What's up guy? He's in the middle of something. Give me the camera, I'll hold I'll hold back. <laughs> That's so brave of you, man. Wait, should I film this? No, don't film this. Hello? Hello? Hi. Hi. What's going on? We're wondering um, if it would bother you if we went and took some pictures of this school for a second. Well, it doesn't bother me, but it's very hazardous because the floor has places where you can go through the floor. Oh, okay. Okay, maybe just outside real quick. We're sorry for the bother. Yeah, we know it's late, sorry. Oh, okay, Is gotcha. It cool if we just take some pictures from outside. Yeah. We won't go in, I promise. Thank you so much. See, we were worried <laughs> all along. She was a nice lady, guys. But what if we she was psyched... not a nice lady? We psyched ourselves out. Let's like take a few pictures outside and then quickly get like a two minute tour of outside. Damn it, like, Sam. <laughs> we always want to push the damn limit, though. <laughs> no, we literally we're... said no. God, this, come on. <laughs> we're only here once. Oh my god. That was like the sketch. That was so thing. She came out, she was like, hello. What? Yeah. Like, Dude, it could have been like a. Like duh, 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 duh. Yeah, I know. Like, I was like, hey, good night, good night, how's it going? Luckily, it was like a. Hello? Not like a. Duh. 1927. Damn. Wow. She was saying that we could fall straight through easily and you'd have to take a tour to know where to step. I'm gonna be the one to fall through the damn floor again, I know it. <laughs> Sure you can really just get fall Look at this, dude. Oh, We've seen God. the bottom, bro. That's oh, a that's a big fall. Oh, oh, he fucking he stuck my finger up my own ass. <laughs> your own finger up your own butt? Yeah. He did Are that. those gunshots in the top? Those two? Oh, oh yeah, right, right there, right there, right there. Oh shit, those two. Yeah. See where the nails are? That's where the beams are. Oh, this seems so sketchy, bro. <laughs> Wait, you don't all have to come in if you don't want. I think we should only stand right here. That's it. Just like a short hallway and then it ends like right there. But then like you can't go this way because there's no more supportive beams. Looks like that was the kitchen or something. Yo, yo, yo. We can't just keep deciding. Fuck, 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 fuck. Yeah, this is sketchy as hell. Let's not get too close. Six feet apart is COVID season. COVID season. How much do you weigh again? Like 140. Do you want to go first? <laughs> you weigh like 145. <laughs> I weigh 160, man. I'll switch. What I've been doing is shining my light and standing on each of these beams, but where the fuck are the beams past here? Dude, you'll, you'll be able to find them. See, look, it's right there. I know, but where's all the fuck was? I'm just going to take a look in each of these rooms and then we'll skedaddle. <laughs> what? Hey. Can you see? What? what? Did you guys see something? No, what? We heard you say something. No. What the fuck? We heard a voice outside. We didn't say anything. I, uh, what? Car coming? Yeah. Go, 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 go. Wait, 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 wait. They're over there. They're over there. 1927s kids just came here to learn and like this was normal in the middle of nowhere, dude. Is this a high school or middle school? Do you know? It was Looks the like entire high school. school. It, was, it was like K through 12. This was like this. this is it? Because of the town was so small. I wonder if there's anyone alive that, that came to the school. They'd be like 100 years old, but. Yeah. That's who I thought yeah. might have lived here, like the principal. I think they were five years old just doing kindergarten in 1927. That means they would be that 105. Would, uh, yeah. Like but what if it was, that's the cornerstone, so that was when it was established. So maybe this was like 20 year old school. So maybe in the 1940s people were still like doing this. So like the that's youngest still is probably like 80, 80, dude. Yeah, that is. It, dude, it's, it's sketchy. Just, it's empty rooms. It's just sketchy so, because it's boring. Yeah. It's sketchy because it's scary. Well, I'm not scared anymore because there was a nice media and there's kitty cats everywhere. Yeah. Giant gas tanks and bikes. Oh, Are those weights down there? Hey, let's go work out. Oh, wait, that's there? not weight. I am an idiot. Wow. Dude, that's fucking cool. Oh my Look at that shot. Whoa. That is dope. My question 
is why did it take all of that and then we had to walk all the way to her door for her to notice like what the fuck was she doing as soon as we walked in that thing wasn't an electrical thing it was a motion sensor yeah so i'm so glad we didn't try to sneak in and we actually yeah, went. we would have got fucking shot because of you guys like yo said so. okay <laughs> everyone here congratulate kian in the comments <laughs> Woo! I know we said this 20 million times. There literally could have been just a bad apple, like douchebag dude that lived here and shot our ass because oh, we. That guy who shot our ass, or the three guys that passed us. So the then bank. why did we risk that, dude? I think that's our Montana treasure right there. Our fucking lives were saved. Dude, I have not felt that courage. Like in Dude, my heart, in so long. I, I, I wasn't gonna say this to you, but like ten minutes leading up to this, I was like, "Fuck!" I feel like the old abandoned the old exploration days, because this is the anxiety that you don't know if you're gonna make it out alive. Yeah, holy fuck. Fucking scary, dude. <laughs> do you want to come back on another trip? Yeah. I do. <laughs> All right, I do. three hundred thousand likes, and we'll come back on another trip. <laughs> Together, bitch. <laughs> Lincoln bio. <laughs> it's like, it's it's cold, dude. Uh, all right, let's go drink some tequila. I got a pizza in my hand. <laughs> What's up, guys? It's Sam and Colby. Welcome guys, to our channel today. This we is have the outro. And Andrew. You oh, guys, no, we're just beginning. This is the outro. Next, this is episode is. four. Episode four. If you guys get three hundred thousand likes right now, counting three. Uh, Dude, if you ask for three hundred thousand likes. Uh, one. Dude, that was a six second verb. I hope you guys enjoyed coming on this journey adventure with us. No, oh, dude, it was One word sick. to describe it. Ready? Go. Fun. Crazy. Anxious. Oh, anxious. Scary. Comment down Fruity. below if you've got anxiety because of this video. <laughs> Text us. At go 70777. Text yes to 7077. It's right here on the 1 800 screen. money back guarantee. Who can eat this in one bite? Oh, I cannot. <laughs> I cannot. Here we Give it a thumbs up first. Give it a thumbs up and follow them and go, go and tell them that we should do more better together collabs. Ooh, I, better together, just, guys. Get the this, merch. Wait, at this point, is the merch already out? Merch doesn't out. make any sense. Merch is out? Yeah, merch is out. Guys, we have some merch together called Better Together because we merch are better together. better together. We are duos, so we perform better together. But when two duos collide and four people do, uh, that is better than better together. We're like that's the best power power together. Boys. That's the best, best together. together. Anyone have a hitchhiker thumb like me? Jason can point back to. I'm <laughs> pointing back to me. Guys, thumbs like, up. To does anyone have a cool thumb like me, though? That looks like it hurts. Grab a strong hand. Leave a like if you enjoyed this video. Comment down below your favorite part. You definitely leave a like. Anyway. South African. Hey, leave a like if you like this video. Let yeah. us know any other treasure hunting you guys want to see, as well as any other creators who you think can step up to the challenge. Who has the balls? Of the Sam Nobody. Who has the Anybody who, who has the cojones? Anybody who lives in Montana, let us know other parts of Montana. We will fly back out here and look for them. Besides Montana. Hannah. We want to go to South America. Where are we not supposed to say that? Brazil? <laughs> here we go. Brazil. Come. Ready? Let us know. All right. Good good job. Job. We'll, we'll see you job. guys next time. Adios. Explore. Go explore. <laughs>